Canada's healthcare system is highly complex and requires adaptive leaders who have the capacity to form networks, inspire others, and think at a system's level. The Conference Board of Canada agrees, reporting a strong link between effective leadership and overall organizational performance, as well as a greater capacity for managing change. Specific to Manitoba, there are examples of localized successes, but we lack a systemic mechanism to translate leadership knowledge, concepts, and techniques into action. To address this need, Manitoba's health institutions have embraced the Leads in a Caring Environment framework. Leads is an evidence-based tool designed specifically for healthcare. It's been widely adopted across Canada. The Leads framework offers a fresh way of thinking. It builds leadership capacity by creating a common leadership language. It will help us grow and support healthcare leaders throughout Manitoba. Leads is comprised of five domains, each represented by a letter within its name. Lead self, engage others, achieve results, develop coalitions, and systems transformation. Each of these five domains features four capabilities, areas in which effective leaders need to be skilled. Let's look at the domain entitled Lead Self. It addresses four capabilities of successful leaders. First, they are self-aware. They have an awareness of their own assumptions, values, principles, strengths, and limitations. They're adept at examining their own emotional triggers and thinking patterns. Second, successful leaders manage themselves. They take responsibility for their own performance and personal health. They realize that in taking responsibility for their own choices, they empower themselves to have greater freedom in how they respond. Third, they develop themselves. They actively seek opportunities for personal learning, character building, and growth. They know that self-development is a lifelong pursuit where the right attitude is as important as the right skills. Finally, successful leaders demonstrate character. They model qualities such as honesty, integrity, confidence, and resilience. Moving along, the E in leads stands for engage others, which tells us that engaging leaders foster the development of others. They support and challenge others to achieve professional and personal goals. They contribute to the creation of a healthy organization. They create an engaging environment where others have meaningful opportunities to contribute and ensure they have access to the resources they need to fulfill their responsibilities. Engaging leaders also communicate effectively. They listen well and encourage an open exchange of information and ideas using appropriate communication tools. Finally, they build teams, which means they facilitate environments of collaboration and cooperation to achieve results. The third domain, Achieve Results, teaches us that goal-oriented leaders set direction. They inspire vision by identifying, establishing, and communicating clear and meaningful expectations and outcomes. They strategically align decisions with vision, value, and evidence. Goal-oriented leaders take action to implement decisions. They act in a manner consistent with organizational values to yield effective, efficient, public-centered service. And finally, goal-oriented leaders assess and evaluate. They hold themselves and others accountable for results achieved against benchmarks and correct the course of activity as appropriate. Develop coalitions, the fourth domain, explains that collaborative leaders purposefully build partnerships and networks to create results. They create connections, trust, and shared meaning with individuals and groups. They demonstrate a commitment to customers and service. This involves understanding the needs of the diverse groups they serve. Collaborative leaders also mobilize knowledge. They employ methods to gather intelligence, encourage open exchange of information, and use quality evidence to influence action across the system. And finally, collaborative leaders navigate socio-political environments. They are politically astute and can manage conflict while mobilizing support. The S within leads refers to systems transformation. Effective leaders should demonstrate systems and critical thinking. They think analytically and conceptually, questioning and challenging the status quo to identify issues, solve problems, and design and implement effective processes across systems. They encourage and support innovation. They create a climate of continuous improvement and creativity aimed at systemic change. Effective leaders orient themselves strategically to the future. They scan the environment for ideas, best practices, and emergent trends that will shape the system. And finally, they champion and orchestrate change. They actively contribute to change processes that improve health service delivery, outputs and products, as well as overall organizational performance. Lead self, engage others, achieve results, develop coalitions, and systems transformation. Championed by key stakeholders throughout Manitoba's health institutions, these five domains of the LEADS framework will help Manitoba grow and support effective leaders within our healthcare system.